Right, are you ready? So this is the one, this is a, this is a monster, this. Proving that root 2 is irrational. So the first thing I'm going to go with is my assumption. Here, the first one. So the first one is that I'm going to assume for a contradiction that root 2 is irrational. Because my thing here is proof that it is irrational. So I'm going to uh, is rational, not rational. Ah, you donkey. There, look, rational. So it can be expressed as a fraction, really, is what I'm saying. So if that fails, then the irrational works. You might think I'm being quite irrational now. So the second one is to write it in terms of a fraction, because I'm saying it's rational. So I'm going to say, so I'm going to write root 2 as m over n, where m and n are integers. n can't be divided by 0, and it can't be simplified. That's the important bit. Can't be simplified. Right then, so then what am I going to do? I'm going to square it. I'm going to get rid of the root 2. I'm going to square it. So that's the one above it. So I'm going to square it. So 2 is m squared over n squared. Now, that should then move on to... We're slightly rearranging it, which is this one here. So then I'm going to rearrange it. So I've got 2n squared is equal to m squared. Now here's my issue. That is even. There. So I've got to find something that talks about 2n squared being even. And that is this one here. So as m squared equals 2n squared, <coughs> m squared must be even. Whenever I'm writing even, really I'm saying a multiple of 2. And that helps you with the root 3 one, because you end up with a multiple of 3. Uh, and hence, m must also be even. If you think 3 times 3 is 9, it's odd. So if it's even, the original number, if you've got an even answer, it must have been the even start point. Even. But once again, multiple of 2 for the harder ones. So that's that one done. Alright then. So our next one is if m is even, now here's my issue. So what I've said is m's even. So moving on, if m's even, actually it's two lots of something else. So as m even can be written as 2k, k is an integer. There, so I've took my m and I've made, because it's even, I can say it's two lots of something else. So m squared is two lots of that something else squared then. Uh, let's find it. So this is the, the bottom one, which is a little bit wordy here. So 2n squared is equal to m squared. But I've said that 2n squared is actually 2k all squared. So 2n squared is 4 k squared, so n squared is 2k squared. That's an even, that's a multiple of 2. So if n squared is even, n must also be even, which runs us on to number 8. You're liking this? I'm running out of time, we have to stop the vid and start again. <laughs>